I promised you guys that I would be delivering a reaction video to the NFL season and the NBA season. Well, guess what, y'all? It's here. Welcome to back. Welcome back once again to Irmo Time. Today, guys, I'll be doing my first ever reaction video um, that I'll be doing to both the NFL season and the NBA season. Both have been crazy and just so energetic that I had to do this video. All right. Let's start off with the NBA. So the Celtics. Let's talk about the Celtics. Kyrie Irving moved to the Celtics, and they have a 10-game winning streak. They started 0-2, and now they have a 10-game winning streak? Are you kidding me? That's crazy. That surprised me. I never thought this would happen. And so I'm not big. I'm not like a big, huge Celtics fan, but I'm not going to lie. I give props to the Celtics for that. And Kyrie Irving has proved that he is the man of that team and he can lead a team without Al Horford or Gordon Hayward, which is incredible. All right, guys. On the other hand, you've got the Cavs who are struggling. I've never seen a LeBron James struggle like this before ever since he was in Cleveland in 2010 and before that. Um, they're just really bad right now. I never expected this. They've got Dwayne Wade. They've got Jeff Green. They've got Derrick Rose and all these guys. And yet, they're like 4-6. and six. They lost to the Rockets last night. LeBron James putting up 33 points. LeBron's doing the best he can. But if the team's not going to perform, and you've got you know, all these role players who aren't doing anything. Iman Shumpert, he's so bad. Iman Shumpert's the guy who's hit the side of the backboard in the NBA Finals. And then you've got Shannon Fry who's doing nothing. Cockover's not performing enough. What's going on, Cavs? You guys got to wake up, help the king. If you guys don't help the king, then what's the whole point of playing on the team? So hopefully I wish the best for the Cavs. I'm not the biggest Cavs fans, but I want them to be successful. <sighs> Anyways, Spurs. I've told you guys many times Spurs are my favorite team. And I've been very pissed off ever since Zaza Pachulia injured Kawhi Leonard in the Western Conference Game 1 Finals. Um... So Kawhi Leonard is set to return soon. He hasn't been playing ever since, and we're doing okay. We're like fourth seed right now. We're not doing too bad. We're like seven and four, right, right, uh, right after Timberwolves. But honestly, I'm anticipated for Tony Parker's return too. He he's set to return in like January, December, and I'm set for Kawhi Leonard to return too. So I wish the best for my team. Best of luck to them. And so yeah. Now guys, moving on to the NFL season. What a season it's been there too. You've got my favorite team, the Seahawks, who are second in the NFC West, I think, right after the Rams. We're 6-3 and three right now. Seahawks are doing really well. We started off kind of shaky a little, but we're doing really well, so props to the Seahawks. Then you've got the Patriots, who've had a bye week last week, and they have been off for quite a while. But you've got Tom Brady, who's 40 years old, who's still doing like, who's averaging like two touchdowns a game, 250 plus yards a game almost. So you've got that too. I honestly, in my opinion, I would say this year's NFL Super Bowl this is going to be a spoiler, but it's going to be Patriots versus Seahawks, in my opinion. I'm calling that right now, guys. Anyone want to bet? Comment down, down below, and I'll bet with you. <laughs> and then you've got the Eagles. Carson Wentz has been phenomenal. They're 8-1. and one. They're number one in the AFC shoot, West or something. They're doing phenomenal, so props to Carson Wentz for performing. Eight and one start. They 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 beat the Broncos like 23-51. So Eagles are doing well too. So a lot of surprises currently going on right now. It's been a crazy NFL and NBA season. I'm excited. I'm pumped to see more of it. I hope you guys are too. Thanks a lot for tuning in to my reaction video. Um, stay tuned for more. I'm sure I'll be doing more as Christmas NBA Christmas games are coming up. NFL Christmas games, Thanksgiving games, and everything. So stay tuned for those. And until the next video, y'all, peace.